Oh, Rick is Rita. You heard about the twin headed dragon making the rounds in Selva? Spooky. Uh oh. Spooky. I bet. In Salva? Oh, look, there's Yule. <laughs> Ah, yes, the dragon in Salva. I've been hearing reports of dragon sightings for a while now. But I guess it's not just a rumor. <laughs> I guess not. Great. First Alan and now... When dragons are involved, nothing good can be happening. We had Final Fantasy VI the eight Alan? dragons. We had Chrono Cross and the six dragons. Oh my lord, dragons. You know dragons always a problem. Dragon? Well, apparently they're trying to find someone to slay the monster for them. Of course, that announcement made about a million people head for Salva, so the problem might already oh, have been great. solved. Oh, uh, great. Great, so the cave is littered with the bones I'm of those who have tried for it and this. failed. Lovely. Well, either way, you won't find me we have a, we have a planet fate of science. More or less. Besides, you guys wouldn't stand a chance against a dragon. RPG logic, anyone could stand a chance against a dragon. If it's not blood, as long as it's battle system. If I were ten years younger, that dragon would have been toast. <laughs> Big fish. Now. Well, if I seriously, I think the guys used to big fish. Oh uh, yes. <laughs> anyway, yep. Uh, let's head into the mine. Let's go check the bar. They're playing the wine about. Why? Oh, uh, you don't even want one here. Here, we'll give you some whining if you freaking push us. That's complaining, not whining. <laughs> Are you sure? We're here to slay the dragon. Yep. We can't let kids running off go you try to fight the dragon. Me. Jeez. You crazy or what? Crazy awesome. We're quite serious, I assure you. Hmm. You heard the lady? Don't say no. You got the right to challenge him. Tis true. Just don't be afraid to run away if you're getting whipped, okay? All right. I don't. I don't think dragons wield dragon whips, though, right? sir. He did mean that literally. Oh, I forgot to mention, there's another warrior in the mines oh. right now. You can work with him if you like, but smells like another party member. His way, okay? But we want all the this? glory to ourselves. <laughs> we can't let him beat us to the punch or yep. the swing, either way. Yep, let's get going. Do, 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 do. We have a dragon slayer to catch. Yep. Oh, by the way, the Salva mines, the beast area has been updated now. This uh -oh. looks difficult. Look out! Here they come! Oh, uh, every time I see the hourglass, I think of the Cave of Trials. <sighs> I got, hate the frickin'. Yeah, we got a Skilla, we have an hourglass, and um, a Jarrell. I hate those things. I, I knew he did for a second. It sounded like the first time he got hit. It sounded like Clutch said <laughs> shit. <laughs> I, know, I think you may have said that before. <laughs> I mean, uh, oh yeah, I forgot. Rita has those overpowered knuckles. This isn't I mean, in the original PS1 release, we did have one of the bo uh, bosses later in the game saying "bastard," and it was still E-rated. So, wow, he distinctly said "bastard," and apparently the ESRB did not care. Wow, what a, that talk about going under the radar? <laughs> no kidding. Subtle much, guys. Be beware of dragons. They're this is the land where dragons rule. They're crazier than I bears. The dragon's lair is up ahead. If we find Dirk, I'm we'll getting out of here. Careful. I don't know. We, he might be an awesome party member. He, he can be used as a meat shield. <laughs> that's not nice. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, work, I, I'm, I'm nice. sorry, but if his name is not Arthur, I don't trust any other knights. Arthur so. can't take hits, though. He can't meat shield anything. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, no. I'm talking about in terms of badassery. Well, okay, that's true. Considering how much he stood up to and put up with. Yeah. You know, print friend, I hate to be the first to say this. I would think I'd be the last, but goddamn it, after all the bullshit you just went through, you better put out. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's not right. Anyway, um, although Dirk Daring is a, quite a badass um, in his own right, even if he did have uh, a very bad NES adaptation of his game, which is not his fault, but yeah, yeah. Don Bluth deserved better than that. <laughs> MU NES game. Yeah, that, that must be the guy. It's the guy from I Want to Be the Guy. You know, we should have had an RPG character as a former guy. I'm sorry. <laughs> we have a few that could have fit. I'd imagine he's here to slay the dragon. You didn't slay the oh, dragon? Right. It's on so my to-do do list! <laughs> <laughs> what kind of knight are you? One of a kind. <laughs> uh, uh, anyway, um... A five full. How nice. <laughs> Great. Well, what, you bet I sent my monster for a five-fold piece? Uh... 
No I'm thanks. just saying, you know, we could do a little better than just five. It's like getting a green rupee in a chest. Okay. Right. <laughs> Anywho, yep, high encounter rate, more or less. Although it's gonna get higher, considering I kind of forgot something about animal instinct and stuff, or scouting in that case. Oh, new enemies. The enemy so much for save points being be safe careful. spots. <laughs> At save point, not safe point. <laughs> Ow! Eh, uh, these these things, these girls are so frail. Oh, so so when the guy at the uh, at the entrance was talking about getting whipped, he was talking about those creatures, not the dragons. Wow. She looks like a beast tamer type, so. I think I, I, I actually think that is what she's called. So it at least makes sense that she'd have a whip. Yeah. Yes, internet. Not for those uses. Nice try. <laughs> and this is why when I was a kid, I didn't understand the whole thing with Quistus. Because I didn't get the whip thing. There. I was think I always thought Castlevania, not other things, and that's why I think Quistus is a badass. But anyway. Oh man, that dragon's all tangled up. I can't tell one end from the other. Now that I mention the guy's fighting with the uh, double blade with, with two swords. That's kind of badass. One for each dragon. That and the fact that he's kind of um, abandoning offense and well, he's abandoning defense for offense. Let's see how things turn out. No, all he needs is, is to is to class change to be what what, oh, what was it the uh, the, the spellblade guys. Damn it, I don't know my Final Fantasy. Five Although before. ironically, you should mention that considering that his fighting style is is said to be that of a, a symbological fencing. So I guess he already knows how True. to do, do the spellblade dual wheel rapid fire. Nice, more or less. Offering Genji glove, well, I bring you better. In fact, he is one of the best characters in the game. One of the best powerful. Um, one of the best physical attackers. You gotta keep your hips down. Uh, hips down? What? Even he's confused. I'm sorry, but could you keep it down a little? <laughs> uh oh. We were trying to encourage you. Sorry. Huh? Eep. Look out! Finishing Whoa. strike. Ouch. Uh oh, he's got mortal tech blizzard fisted. Damn it, Vargas. Man. I thought I had gone blind for a moment there. Where'd he go? <laughs> huh? Come back, famed swordsman! We wanted to give you our congratulations! <laughs> oh boy. Uh oh. Right behind you! What? No, he's not! Hey, you guys, did you see where the dragon went? Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 how, how, are supposed, how are we supposed to say this? I, I've heard of a monkey on, on your back, but this is just excessive. Um, and I thought I had problems. <laughs> it's on your back. What are you talking about? Dragging uh, that big can't be uh, on uh, my. Uh, oh! <laughs> dragons on my back, dragons! Somebody do something! Um. Um. Well, at least you're all right. But all all right. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. All right. All right. All right. I have dragons on my back. Are you shrink wrapped? I have dragons oh, on my back. I really couldn't tell you. Uh. Oh, look at it. It's got to be the dragon I was just fighting. Why is it latched on to me like this? I I think he likes you. Maybe, maybe he well, just likes you. That's uh, what it is. I'm not sure what to say. Oh. Great. This wouldn't have happened if you hadn't distracted me with all that noise you were making. Uh, just we're just trying to help. Sorry. Oh, he was that <laughs> close to winning. Uh, we're trying sorry. to encourage you, not distract you. I'm sorry. You have to take responsibility for this. What? Oh boy. I said you have to take responsibility for this. Look at me. I'm permanently disfigured. Permanently disfigured. <laughs> <laughs> I, I didn't catch that. <laughs> I'm not accusing the actor, but it sounded slight like it might have been stuttered, which kind of fits considering he'd be panicked. <laughs> the character probably could stumble what over his think? words. Um. What? Hmm. Oh, come on. Well, it is our fault. It's the least you could do for ruining my life. How whoa, whoa, Tony. Let, let's get uh, get off the drama couch, shall we? <laughs> Jeez, dude, it could be uh, worse. They could have eaten you. I'll, I'll take responsibility. Okay. We'll try to make up for this. You will? Besides, that dragon really didn't like you, it could still, you know, take a bite out of you. That's right in range for it. 
Well, good. I'm glad to hear you're willing to admit your mistake. We'll start looking right now. Uh, thus, why we're going to be delayed right. from Let's going go. to Lucor. Because we have uh, temporarily, we have recruited the world's most unlucky right. swordsman. Meet Ashton Anchors. Ashton Anchors. Again, I Arguably one of my favorite characters in this game. He is one of the best characters in terms of physical uh, attacks. Yeah. And too. certainly one of my favorites. Yep. Yes, Ashton Anchor is born September 28th, age 20. And obviously uses short swords. Dual wield, no less. Yeah. Uh, again, I mean, we saw that, but it's still badass. Favorite food is the hamburgers. And his favorite instrument is the piano. Sword's been playing a piano. That just presents an interesting mental image. Uh huh. Anyway, also, uh, uh, let's see. In English, in the second story, voiced by David uh, Babich, um, who voiced uh, Prince Albert and uh, Melbu in *The Legend of Dragoon*. Huh. Wow. In second evolution, so voiced by someone named uh, Jeffrey Maxwell. <laughs> oh, and of course. Uh, which is, what's interesting is the fact that, um, oh yeah, I might as well mention this, if, by recruiting Ashton, we barred recruitment of another character. Actually, two characters. Um, I would like to know what a swordsman is doing when they're wearing an ugly accessory, but... <laughs> then, then again, he has the, he has the worst luck. He has a fixed luck stat of 18. Poor guy, just... And, yeah, other things about Ashton, when... Dragons actually can possess and speak through him. It's, it only happens once, as far as I know. But in, in there was an anime of Star Ocean, obviously Star Ocean 2, that is. And when that happens, his eyes change colors depending on who is possessing him. Color coded for your convenience. That is not just that, but he has, as he's as this guy has mentioned constantly, he has an obsession with barrels. Just that still blows my mind. Also, uh, you play too much Star Fox. That's the only explanation I come up with. I guess. Also, if you uh, have priests in the same party as Ashton, Be careful, everyone. and uh, they, both of them have friendship points of eight or higher towards each other, later on in the game, um, depending on if Ashton has a sword dance special art, priests can um, learn a new skill from that. I remember that PA. Yeah, that was. Interesting, to say the least. <laughs> Interesting. Wait. Also, he has a pretty awesome skill we can only get in uh, the Maze of Tribulations, known as Tri Ace. We better be careful. Uh, basically, it's a uh, it's a stop spell, more or less. Uh, that, 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 yeah, it stops time in battle and hits the whole screen like a spell. Well, that's not cool. Come on, o only no, no, you should not be allowed to use that attack. Ow! Something. Got knocked down. Okay, it's not a so it's not a stop spell. It's just that it stops time like a spell. It hits the whole screen. Right. Still, starlight cheese. And like Priestess, he has multiple victory poses. Huh? I only remember one for Ashton. Interesting. One of one, 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 one involves a normal victory pose. The other one involves. The same pose, but with a dragon's comically chewing on his head. Oh, maybe I just haven't noticed that. Okay, I thought it meant drastically different. Uh huh. But yeah, he does have the fastest standard physical attack of everybody in the party. And oh! Ow! That really hurt. I knew there was a reason I didn't like those damn gels. Yeah. Ugh, I hate them. And it may know us the counter rate is skyrocketed now. For for no reason whatsoever other than the fact that I wasn't using scouting with the right character. I mean seriously. Uh, there we go. There we go again. Eventually we'll get out of this damn mine. Ah Seriously. There, we're finally out. We got a deadly poison bomb. What a consolation prize. And a piece of gold. Oh, by the way, if you visit the weapon shop here, after you recruit Ashton, you get um, a special weapon for him. Twin Splicers. Uh, 
Uh, I think it's no, good. they won't change your cure into. Oh, I'm sorry. All yeah. Kind of splicers. <laughs> yeah, but no. Uh, actually, the PS1 version Ash is the best character to kill the two super bosses of the game. I'm not sure if he still is in the PSP version. <laughs> we have a quick. No, don't be modest. Take this. Uh, I'm, okay. not, I'm not gonna say no to free weapons, especially since it offers a 300 point upgrade. It's not bad, certainly. Well, 20 is a step up from 5. <laughs> yeah. Really? Oh. Really? Yeah. You edited that on purpose, didn't you? I'm kidding. No, I didn't. It, Damn it's... you, game. How did you know from years into the. Ah. And one of the rare times I'm actually gonna use an N. I don't like this game. It reads minds. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. I thought it was one of your favorite games of all time. <laughs> no, I just had to make a silly reference to Ice Age, that's all. Mm -hmm. But yeah, he uh, has the norm fastest normal attack, but his running speed is the slowest, and he his special arts are slow and situational, so you need timing to use them properly. It's well, yeah. some logic to that, though. I can... But then again, he, he does rely on um, brute force. Well, I'll put it this way. At least he's not like Jack from the City where you need precise timing, like for real. Just uh, so how are we goddamn combos. Guy is tough to learn. Uh, I don't have a clue to yeah, be Now honest. he gets a character portrait. Of which, course. Which, of course, due to sprite bearing, it in. flips. Of course. Uh. Down, boys. Eel. Eh? What was that? The dragon. He's telling you to quit whining about The red one, I believe. <laughs> <laughs> you understand uh, them? Guys are pissing me off. Aww. <laughs> oh, Claude. Really? I think they're kind of cute. Uh, oh. Oh. You, you think? Mm, I wonder if this... What I think is about to happen is about to happen. I like how this one has yep. This one of the more controversial has. moments in this port. Aww. And the eyes on this one are all sad. Like a lost puppy. It's cute. Cute, huh? Hey. I think there are more important things to think about right now, Reyna. Well, don't name it, because if you name hey, it, you'll get attached to it. Now names. put the thing back where it came from, or so help names? me! Or so help me, and so help me, and so help me, and stop! <laughs> <laughs> it's it, it's a work in progress, but hey, we need others. With them for a while, right? Well, you got a point there, Reyna. <laughs> yeah, but... Mm. Now let me think. Uh... That look. Bad things happen with that look. I know. Let's call the one with the scary eyes creepy and the one with the sad eyes weepy. Uh, They'll be God. creepy and weepy. I guess it's got a nice ring to it. Call me obsessed with the train if you must, but I still that prefer Kyoro so Dururan, but anyway. That's... <laughs> Claude agrees with you, apparently. Nothing. Nothing. He said that is so dumb. <laughs> so what are we gonna do now? We haven't got a single thing to go on. Well, clearly we need to find a place that is a repository we'll of knowledge. Have to go and do some research. Hmm. Huh? Research? Well, really? That's so boring. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe if we go someplace where there are a lot of books, we'll be able to find some information that'll give us some idea. Hmm. Well, where, where, where oh sure, let's that. go to the town so library. I'm sure it has plenty on this. Well, there's one here in Cross, actually. The Elder in Mars had a lot of books at his place, didn't he? Well, it's a good place to start as any. Oh, and yeah. on tomorrow's Maybe edition of Reading Rainbow, live on location, the Library of Mars. <laughs> so we're going to learn about exorcism. Take a look, it's in a book. A Reading Rainbow. Uh, uh, anyway. Yeah, I'm sure exorcism is real friendly for the children. <laughs> well, then again, it says T-rated now. That's true. On <laughs> exorcism. Time, but... He has been possessed by alien form shall find a solution within. Hey, this is it! Oh, I found so when you have salvation really does lie within. <laughs> hmm. Oh, unnecessary reference anyway. Anyway, uh, now a rare sprite of Claude reading a book. Yeah, Claude. That that was an insult, the Claude. <laughs> of a monster must be carefully performed depending on the type of creature possessing I'm surprised the he can read that. <laughs> yeah, it is a foreign planet. Right. You'd think the uh, communicator would only work with, with spoken words, not written, dragon, so... Interesting. Unless... The king's tears as they fall from the sky into the holy unless it's something like um, the basic language in Star Wars. And where would we find this that's, that's possible, yeah. I, I guess as much like currency seems to be kind of universal around here. Calm, Wherever you go, the take full. Even in 
Okay, that's that's Water. Boy's Destruction Three. But so just what, saying. Is it in the ocean or a lake somewhere? Uh -huh. Oh. If it's a lake, then I suppose Lake Cole could be a possibility. That's on the northwest side of Cross. Hmm. But what about that maternal womb bit? I don't get that. Uh, hold on. That must be referring to the mountain palace. Oh, that place! It's right next to Lake Cole. We'll have to visit that Those as Claude as well. Ears shall embark upon a treacherous path to the mountaintop and brace for any challenge. It's also a good place to grind, but anyway. <laughs> yeah. Early on, yeah. Tears yep. from the sky. It's talking about some kind of mountain bird, maybe. Great thinking, Sherlock. Then it could be the well, at least it's not tears of the sun, across. but anyway. Supposedly, it's the home to some giant demon birds. Well, let's see the what tears else. Tears will be yours once you grasp victory from the ruler of the skies. We have to beat Airman, but nobody okay. can beat Airman. No. No air man this time. The of the <laughs> oh, thank God. We never be able to finish this game then. The tears to your mouth and, recite the following incantation. and then what? <laughs> He's... And then I'll be free, right? Well, that's just like, I love you so hard right now, Claude. Thank you. <laughs> the demonic dragon shall vanish from this world. Ugh. Demonic seems kind of harsh, though. But. Mm. Creepy and weepy will be. killed? Yeah. Did you genuinely expect something else? What, were you expecting them to just be what cut off me? from Ashton? I think cutting, cutting him off would be just as bad. I'm pretty sure they'd still die and Ashton with him, but... Yeesh. Don't you think that sounds a little too brutal to kill them like that? Yeah, I don't think there's a reason to go to oh, that level on. of extreme. Guess the cuter side of the argument's winning, huh? <laughs> you should be used to that by now, shouldn't you, Claude? <laughs> they're in agreement. I can feel this not forming whether or not it's it's whether or not this is seems a little, is well this whole thing is a little ham fisted. I still feel sympathy for both stuff. sides, honestly. <laughs> Ashton kind of has a right there to go, go through life without dragons on his back, but the dragons aren't really die. So. Wait, what? Have you gone mad? This is not me. As I is. You think I'm just gonna let it go like this? Actually, there's still two of them, but anyway. <laughs> well, in that case, let's head to the mountain palace. Yeah, the first things first, first. We'll do this one Everybody step at a time. Pointless unless we have that in hand. At least it'll give everyone time to think. Ashton, uh, uh nothing. Never mind. Hmm. It seems so wrong to have an Ashton without creepy. Yeah, it just, it just wouldn't be right. Ah, crap, the phone's going off. <laughs> Be right back. Nintendo Helpline, stop calling us! <laughs> no, no. The Mountain Palace is on the northwest side of Cross. Let's go! Click call for Mr. Bob, we ought to baby. It's a boy. Sorry, wrong number. <laughs> Who was that, dear? Bob. You had a baby. It's a boy. Oh! <laughs> Oh lordy. Boy, those damn things are so expensive. They're useful, but damn, they're expensive. Of course, I think you can eventually start making them just like Star Ocean 3, but still, until then, they can be a little expensive. You know, I'm trying to think, why would we be heading to the castle and cross him? Oh, well, okay, I suppose we have to... But still... Hmm. Oh, all those random items being acquired. <laughs> I mean, as much as I appreciate free stuff, it'd just be nice if it did so silently. You don't have to tell me all the stuff you're getting me, just, just surprise me! Make a formal request, your majesty. Oh, yes, right, we need to specifically permission to get up there. I can't believe I forgot about that. Be. It just seems a little far removed from from Cross. Seems like a bit of a hike to go to the mountain house. I just forgot it was oh, under this guy's jurisdiction, technically. To exercise the dragon from this man's body side, I'm surprised to let someone like him into this place, considering they might think the dragon's too dangerous. But then it gets an, then it gets an RPG. 
I, I know, again, logic, but I'm just... <laughs> In that case, so be I'm sorry, it. got to you pull away, it was the hospital. I gotta go the in for class. Overrun with fearsome monsters. You must Oof. exercise extreme caution. No kidding. Oh, yeah, no kidding. I've been wiped out in there before, and, um... Yeah, you, you guys know I like to overlevel. That's not good, so... <laughs> <laughs> this, it, I, but in this game, you have to. Journey. It's, it wasn't even that I was actually, you know, killed. It was paralysis. Uh-huh. I Thank never you, can't get majesty. used to that. I can't get used to the whole everybody's paralyzed, you, you lose. It's just... Uh -huh. Ugh. Mm -hmm. But yeah, like I mentioned, so it was the hospital calling me, setting up a class for the 26th at 1 o'clock. Uh, probably people don't realize what I'm talking about, but maybe especially don't. That's why I wasn't going to say anything, but I was just like, okay, that's... I figured you were more telling me than the audience, so that's why I was going to... Oh, telling both. Yeah. Anyway, but what were you saying? I couldn't hear what you were saying. Sorry, I was trying to hold the fort while you were gone. <laughs> oh, makes sense. Alright then. Well, okay, I guess we're headed off to um, the Mountain Palace. We're heading off to adventure. And beyond. Alright then, well, we gotta take the long way over to the Mountain Palace. I had actually forgot that it w that you had to talk to the King of Cross before you go there, because uh, the Mountain Palace seems kind of a little physically far from the, uh, where the castle is. I didn't really I didn't remember it was in his jurisdiction. Uh, it's <laughs> quite a hike. <laughs> yeah, and us without Bunny Call. Seriously. On the plus side, we did uh, fight all the monsters here, so. Hell, I tell you, Barney Call even just get us through this damn thing. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Anyway. Where's the chocobo lure when you need it? <laughs> uh, not here. Yeah, that's for sure. Duh. And besides, I don't really want. I don't really want to go back to seven. Well, well, they had chocobo stables in six, so that's not as bad, right? Not as bad, no. Right. At least you didn't have to do any breeding. Anyway, uh, yeah. Talk about a game that is totally inferior to this, in my opinion. Besides, that, that could be saved for when I do finally get around to uh, to playing that for my channel, since I and actually can now. Yeah, at least you'll take that off my hands. Oh, gladly. But in terms of having someone join you, I want dibs. Uh, that includes chocobo reading, by the way. Yes, I'll be doing that. Well, don't feel, don't feel bad. I had to do it as well. Are you kidding? I love chocobo races. No, no, no. I so mean, I'll I, put up with the breeding. I, so. I, mean, I had a PS1 master file of FF7, and I did get the golden chocobo. Yeah. Did you read it or did you get it for beating Ruby Weapon? No, I never beat the weapons. <laughs> oh, okay. I did it the old-fashioned way. It's a master file, but you don't have all the stuff from the weapons. Nope. Come on. <laughs> I, I can't. It's been too long. Anyway. Yep. Five full again. <laughs> <laughs> can't get away from those fives. <laughs> it, oh my god, it's Subway. Five. Five dollar. Five dollar food low. God damn it, Subway, <laughs> I hate you and your earworm commercials. Yeah, see you guys in part 15.